President Dr. Mohamed Irfan Ali says the Caribbean region and Africa must develop a structured mechanism for enhanced trade relations. The President was at the time speaking during an interview with the African Prosperity Network after receiving the African Prosperity Champions Award. He said that greater intra-regional trade and integration policies can open doors for significant investments. With these policies in place, the Caribbean and Africa would be better positioned to utilize each other's goods and services for shared development. And I think we need to set ourselves targets, like to increase our internal trade uh, by 30 percent. That is reducing our external uh, dependence by 30 percent by 2030. And I think once we set ourselves these targets, we will be able to build mechanisms that promote trade among ourselves. If that Guyana's geographical location and budding relationship with Africa allows it to act as a critical link between the two regions. Now, Guyana allows uh, African investment to have access to a market of over four, 400 million. And that is markets that we have trade agreements with, trade arrangements with. It opens up all of South America to African investors. And with the type of development that is taking place in our country, where we are trying to put Guyana as a leader on climate, food, and energy, Africa can play a very key role. The president also said that it is critical that human resource development is prioritized. He pointed to the emergence of digitization and said that countries must invest in their human resources so they can cope with these changes and adapt to the new environment. As we seek to add value to our natural resources, to our to our manufacturing, to our agricultural production, we need to have a greater skill set. We need to have the de de uh, deploy great technology, better technology, better ways of doing things. More, uh, we need to spend more on research and development, and all of this requires greater investment in our human asset. Earlier this year, the president received the Global Africa Leadership Award, which recognized his strong and transformational leadership. He said that the award signifies the connection between Africa and CARICOM.